Okay guys, it is time for the moment of truth. You have made it all the way to part six of these videos, which is pretty awesome. By now, your science video should be looking great and all of your reactions should just be wowing all of your classmates. So now we need to do the part where we're actually going to publish it, save it to our Google Drives, and save it with your teacher or share it with your teacher so she can do the grading. So what you're going to do when you're happy with your video is go to publish. Once you're at publish, um, depending on how long your video is, try it first with the 720 HD, that's the free one. Um, if your video is too long and it gives you an error message, then you can go down to the 480p, but try the 720 if you can. Before you click publish though, there are a couple things you want to do. First of all, we for sure want to click our Google Drive. So click on that, and if you haven't signed in, sign in again with your um, VCS Badger email address and password. This is what it's going to do to actually save it to your Google Drive. So click Accept. And you know you've done it right when that changes to a colorful icon and says that it's connected. The next thing we want to do is change this setting. Right now it's set to public. So once you push pub publish, anyone can see your video, and we don't really want that. So go ahead and click it and change it to private so that it's the red lock. Once you've done all these things and everything looks good, you are going to want to go ahead and click publish the video. It's going to ask if you will give your feedback. Um, you can go ahead if you want to or click cancel if you don't want to. I'm going to give it a 10 because I really like this software and I think it's awesome that it's free. So I'm going to click send. And now you're going to see up here it says processing and then it will have the name of your video. It says please do not restart the publishing process. And then it says that once your video is ready they're going to send you an email. So this actually does take quite a while um, to publish it, and they will send you an email to your Google account, so your VCS Badger account when it's done. So you can actually completely X out of the browser if you want, because like I said, it is going to take a long time, and you're just going to want to kind of check your email until it appears there. So go ahead and exit out. Now we just need to go to your Google Drive and actually share it with your teacher for grading and so that she can watch it too. So go ahead and open up a internet browser, it doesn't matter which one, and you're going to go to www.google.com slash drive. Once you get to this splash screen, click go to Google Drive. Um, here you're going to have to sign in with your VCS Badger username and password. I was already signed in, but if you aren't, um, go ahead and enter those in right now, and it will take you to this place where it shows all of the files in your drive. Here you can see I have a Clarence the Dog MP4, and that is what your project will look like. It will be an MP4 file, so it will say whatever you named your project and then MP4. In order to share it with your teacher, you're going to go up here and click the little person with the plus sign. Okay, once this box comes up, we're going to do a little bit of finagling. Um, go ahead and click this, and then click more. You're going to want to make sure it says on anyone with a link. So again, just make sure any it says anyone who has a link can access it, no sign-in required. That means that if you want to send it to your grandparents or if you want to send it to your parents to look at, regardless of what email address they have, they can look at it. And then I also want you to change this for now to can edit. You can change that later if you're afraid that someone will mess with your video, but for now I need you to put it on can edit. Um, and I will tell you why in just a moment. So once you have those settings changed, go ahead and click Save. Okay, now this is where you're going to enter in the email addresses. So first and foremost, you need to share it with your teacher. So um, she will either have you send it to her ESU email address or her VCS Badger email address. So you can ask her which one. For now, I'm just going to put in her ESU email address. So enter in the email address and then hit enter. And now I also want you to share it with me. My email address is sbernthal at esu17.org. 
And the reason you're sharing it with me and the reason that you had to put Ken Edit here is that I'm actually going to make a copy of your video and I am going to put it into one big um, movie that your teacher can show at parent teacher conferences or whenever she would like to. So that's why you have this Ken Edit for now. At the end of the school year, if you would like to change that, you certainly can. But for now, just leave it at Ken Edit and share it with your teacher and with me. Um, once you have those in, go ahead and click send, and it will send your teacher and it will send me a link to your video, and I'll go ahead and put it together so that you can see all your classmates in one long movie. Um, thank you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed this pro project. If you have any questions or comments, you can certainly email it to me. Um, other than that, I can't wait to see your projects, and I hope you had fun. Thanks, guys.